we've already established that uh, we have a relationship here between customers and orders so we're going to model this as a main and sub form um, in our forms so what we want to do is we want to make our main form to model the customers table and that's going to be shown the one side of the relationship so one record will be shown in the customers side of the form and many records will be shown in the orders side of the form so the orders form is going to actually going to be a sub form and it's going to be linked by customer ID so both forms will be linked by customer ID so if we close relationships window and we load up our form customers as it stands now we can see that we have a number of customer records and just below it here we're going to add our sub form so if we close that and we create, uh, create a new form and for now we're going to select auto form data sheet there's different ways of creating a sub form but this is probably the quickest way um, as part of the tutorials that I'm showing you and if we select our data source it's going to be orders and click the OK button and access will go away and cre create our sub form as you can see it looks very much like a Excel spreadsheet just widen the columns a bit um, we have our primary key at the beginning order ID which is an auto number and we have our foreign key at the end customer ID which is actually going to be linking back to our customer table so now if we close this new form and we'll save it give it a name form I've called that form customer sub click OK OK so we can now see in the database window we've got our new form form customer sub so we just need to add that now to our main form